morning and welcome to the 2023 Korea Drone Show. We are here in beautiful Busan, South Korea at Bexco. This is the biggest drone show in this part of the world, especially in Korea. It is filled with all sorts of exhibitors, buyers, different conferences, events that you can attend, all sorts of stuff as well that you can try, kind of different exhibits and um, things you can experiment with. It's taking place over the next three days here in Busan. Today is the first day, Thursday. We've just had the opening ceremony. It will also take place over Friday and Saturday. You're welcome, of course, to join us. So let's get started here at Bexco. All right, so here at the Drone Show 2023 at Bexco in Busan, we're going to look at this here, which is Kangwon Tech. Hello, 안녕하세요. Hello, 안녕하세요. Can you tell me about your company? Um, 저희 하이리움 산업 주식회사는 2014년도에 설립이 되었고요. 어, 키스트라고 한국 과학기술원 연구원에서 그 스피노프된 회사입니다. 그 so this company has been around since 2013. They are a spin-off of actually KAIST, which is one of the universities here, um, and their research center. So it around is its own functioning company, but it's a spin-off, of course, from the research center. 저희 회사는 대한민국에서 최초로 자체적으로 수소를 액화할 수 있는 기술을 개발을 했고요. 그것에 대한 의미 자체는 우주선이나 로켓의 연료가 될수 있는 기술을 자체 개발했다는 거가 커다란 의미가 될 수가 있겠고. 그렇게 해서 생산된 에카수소의 가장 그 대표적인 사용처가 바로 드론입니다. 드론인데 기존의 드론 시스템들은 길어야 한 30분 정도 배터리 개발은 근데 수소 드론은 그보다 좀더긴 시간을 비행을 할 수가 있는데 에카수소로 치환을 하게 되면 익스트림리 10시간 이상 비행이 가능합니다. So they are the first company in Korea to be doing this kind of work with these drones here. So the certain um like unmanned specificities that it has. Um, and so we'll have a look at some of them as well. So what are these here? What are we looking at? 그 에콰수소의 시작은 사실은 이런 굉장히 저중량 탱크로 할 수가 의미가 있습니다. 리포터 분께서 한번 들어봐 주시겠어요? 얼마나 가벼운지. <웃음> oh well, I can, can hold it myself. Yes, yeah, that is crazy. That's super light. Yes. How heavy is it? Like 1kg oh. 미만. 아마도 재질적으로 그냥 타이타늄 재질인데요. Yeah. 아마 전 세계 최초로 드론용 타이타임 탱크를 저희가 제작을 했습니다. Wow, so this obviously it's crazy light. I was able to pick it up, and so it's able to um, because it's made of titanium, and so because it is so light, then it can have so much more functionality for unmanned drones that are flying. Yeah. Yes. 그래서 이 드론 이 탱크를 탑재한 드론을 여기에서 보실 수가 있는데요. Oh, and so there it is. Yeah, in yes. use. Okay. 그래서 연료 전지가 이 기체 안에 탑재가 되어져 있고 mm -hmm. 이 탱크에서 약화 수소 공급을 통해서. 10시간 정도의 비행이 가능하게 된 거죠. Wow. So because it's so light, it can actually fly for 10 hours just on this one tank. So flying for 10 hours obviously gives you a lot of um, kind of capability. So I can see the streamlined design there for aerodynamic drag reduction. Um, it obviously is applicable to several industries as well. Yeah. 네, 그래서 좀 비극적인 이야기이긴 하지만 작년에 발생된 어, 우크라인 전쟁 oh. 때문에 그 국방 측면에서도 10시간 이상의 비행이라는 굉장히 큰 의미를 가지고 있거든요. Mm -hmm. 그래서 한국에서의 국방부를 통해서 굉장히 많은 해외 기업과 어, 무기 개발을 하는 업체하고도 협업을 진행을 하고 있습니다. So they've had a lot of interest from international companies because of its ability to fly for so long. For example, considering the Ukraine war as well, where they need to have that ability to fly things for a long time in a conflict zone, so it's got to be able to last and not, um, you know, need to be up and down in the air. Then that obviously gives it a lot of functionality. So it's been popular there with international companies. Yeah. So 그래서 한국뿐만이 아니고 그 국제적인 많은 그 드론 솔루션 개발 업체가 협업을 진행을 하고 있고요. 그것을 위해서 일단 현재 미국 법인과 유럽 법인을 출범을 시켰습니다. Yeah, and I, well, it kind of um, starting to work with companies in the US and Europe. I see. Yes. 그리고 뒤에 보시는 것 같은 그 운송 트레일러와 같은 경우들은 미국의 차트사와 합자 법인을 출범을 시켰습니다. So then also, as you can see there, that trailer that's able to carry that hydrogen, as we know, it's really difficult to tra transport hydrogen. Um, they're able to work with that company there to do it so much more easily. Wow. So I'm going to point it out here. So as we said, so it's this trailer that we're talking about that transports the hydrogen. Chart itself is a company that's been around for quite a long time. So they have a lot of experience. And so being able to collaborate with them has been great for both. <laughs> Yes. Okay. Thanks. Yes. How about one little 
무엇보다 도 해외에서 오신 바이어분들이 조금 더 많은 홍보를 전달하고 싶어서 참석을 하게 되었습니다. So they wanted to attend today because they've got these great products and so they want to be able to communicate some of that to people who are interested. Also here attending in Busan, there's lots of international buyers so they want to have a chance to meet them. And your next steps or next research plans? Uh, 그 비행 시간을 늘리고자 하는 노력들을 계속 하고 있고요. 어 거기를 따라서 기네스 레코드에 도전할 계획을 가지고 있습니다. Yes, so they for next steps. Obviously, there's a lot that they can do here to keep you know improving these and making them better. So that will be part of their research for new products next year. Maybe next year we'll see new products here. Okay, well, thank you so much. That's great. Thank you. Bye bye. Thank you so much. Bye bye. Yes, here again, looking at interesting stuff with hydrogen here in Busan.